I think there are many different sorts of artists in the arts industry. I mean, there are, there are also many of my friends who just want to make better and better art. They're not interested in social political comment. Uh, they're not. They're not truly interested in entertainment. Also, you know, they're not interested in being bread and butter artists. They want to make good art, and uh, there, so there's a whole spectrum of different different individuals who have different artistic positions. I mean, there's a lot of um, of artists I know in Singapore who. Um, uh, have become tired of the social political space. They feel they can't say too much, so they just concentrate on the aesthetics, because that's how you are encouraged in Singapore. Which is that uh, when when your performance is allowed by the IMDA, we know for sure this is a safe performance. So you know, for myself as an artist, I'm beginning to doubt there can be uh, uh, there can be true critique in art. Because by the time it's gone through those stations, you know, gone through those stations, there's nothing left in there. You you can you know, there's nothing radical. There's nothing even imaginative left. A, a play that's been that's been that's been allowed to be performed. That's 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 the reality, right? It's when you get a permit, it's a play that's allowed, and you're allowed because why? You're safe, and therefore, uh, it's. It's a reality for myself that I, I begin to doubt more and more that we can really have strong, um, uh, deep, critical discourse in the theatre because by, by that time everything's been censored out and you're just, you're just sanitised. Right and um, um, but I I would say that that's why also um, uh, the the National Arts Council the government the arts industry is so much um, discussing funding and what what are the conditions of funding because if there is no funding uh, um, you can't make work in a very expensive city uh, but if there's funding you don't say anything bad about me. So this is something which is very, very uh, direct. And I, I think that um, it's really like uh, you've, you've, uh, you, you've caught, uh, you've caught uh, uh, the individual by the neck in a way, right? Because it's about, it's about a very essential need, which is funding to make things in this very expensive city. So I have the reverse because I, I like to think that you know, the, the government should leave the arts completely and make everything into a free economy. You know, that means that they don't support anything. You, you can thrive or not thrive based on how you build up your economic resources yourself. There is no funding and hence no regulations. And uh, um, at the same time, also that uh, the government should not compete with the independent arts groups to get funding. Because right now, uh, it's a very, very basic issue that right now, uh, uh, for most independent arts companies, our, our biggest competitor is the Arts Council, is the National Arts Council who's getting the money. And most corporations want to be good corporate citizens. They're not going to sponsor a small independent dance company. It's better to support, let's say, the whole uh, festival or the dance program, or national dance program. So actually, the, the, the biggest competitor for, for uh, corporate funding is actually the National Arts Council. Um, so it's a very complicated space because on, on one level, uh, funding is grabbed by the government. Uh, that means, like uh, I would say, funding, uh, corporate funding is grabbed by them, and then after that, regulations are slapped on. So um, I, I prefer like um, all this. We've been having so many struggles about funding. Means you cannot say this. You have to take the money and don't bite the hand that feeds you. I prefer that no funding for everything, uh, and then we're completely free. But just don't compete. Yeah, and also don't compete. Yeah, and I, I, but I think that that's something which it's it's a uh, it's too scary a proposition because it's really it's really uh, 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 really kind of uh, taking up the challenge which is always presented to the art scene, which is that if you can survive, uh, uh, do it lah, right? I mean that's that's a general attitude. If you can find your audience, do it. And yes, we can find our audience, but then everybody is a, is a, is a scene which starts from uh, from stage zero. Right? It's a completely free economy with, without unfair competitions. Yeah.